This video will show you how to create distribution lists. To send emails or letters to any group of contacts, you will need to create distribution lists. We will use the scenario of a list that contains all customers with active policies that are set to expire within the next 90 days. Distribution lists are stored in the marketing section of QQ Catalyst. Click on Marketing in the global navigation bar. Select the bulk email print menu item. The distribution list page appears. Click on the add new list icon on the toolbar. The first page in this guided workflow is the select data source page. To begin, choose a category. Customers, carriers, MGAs, employees, or prospects. As you click on each selection, Notice that the data sources on the right are changing. Select the Customers category as this will be a distribution list of customers. The Customer Information Data Source is automatically selected by QQ Catalyst. This distribution list is about policies that are set to expire within 90 days, so we will also choose the Policy Information Data Source. Now we have both customer information and policy information to create our distribution list. Click Next to go to the Set Criteria page. This is where you can set the criteria used to build your distribution list. Click on the Add Filters button in the middle of the page. Click on the Column field and start typing in the word Expiration. Just type in a few letters. You don't have to type in the entire word. We will select expiration date from the drop down list. Leave is between as is and then type in the desired 90 day window for expiring policies that we want. To add additional filters, click on Add Another Filter. Here we can further filter the list. For instance, only customers whose mailing address is in a zip code that starts with 33. When you are done with entering filters, click on Next to go to the preview page. Give the distribution list a name, such as Expiring Policies. Write in a description of the list and click on Customer in the Type drop-down list. Putting in a type helps to find the list later on when you are searching among many lists. When you click Save, this will take you back to the library of distribution lists. If you have a lot of distribution lists, you can use the search box on the list view to find your list. Enter the word expiring to search for your list. Click on the list and note that you may edit this list, create a duplicate of the list with a different name, delete the list, or create a bulk email print job using the distribution list. Here is what you have just seen in this video. How to select the data for your list. How to set the criteria for your list. How to search for a distribution list. And where to edit, duplicate, or delete a distribution list.